Hey y'all, I'm going to show you real quick the um, cross stitch quilt blocks I'm doing. These are a junior size of 18 inches. They have the sew lines and the cut lines. This is the cut line. This is the sew where to sew them together. They also have these wonderful lines right here of how to free motion it. How stinking ass cool is that? These are all free motion lines. And then you embroidery or cross stitch this piece and this is the dresden plate one and um they come in two per sheet and i've got three sheets so i've got nine blocks right two four no i got six blocks anyway yeah sorry guys i can't count today may have had a little drink a drink anyway um so i've got i've started i've started them um, and what I'm doing is I'm sewing, I'm stitching them, and then I'm going to cut them and square them up. But they are really huge blocks, and I love this. It's only going to be a little quilt because obviously there's only six blocks. Uh, but this is Jack's Jack Dempsey Needle Art. And uh, here's its number. But... Um, I, I know I'm supposed to put the link on the last video, and of course, you know me, I can't get my shit together and put the links on. Um, but I think it was everything cross stitch, and then cross stitch one, two, three has them too. But everything cross stitch has the option of you buying the floss. Um, the other ones, it just comes in this with the paper, and then you the paper on the back has the um, the floss numbers. So, anyway, I thought that was so cool that um, it has, because I was talking to my husband, and I was like, you know, it'd be so cool if I could do the, because on the, on the chart, or the picture, it shows this being done on a quilting machine, and I was like, man, that'd be so cool if I could figure out how to free motion quilt that, and lo and behold, I open it up, and there's the lines, so I'm definitely going to be buying more of these kits, um, because they do have the sunbonnet sue and y'all know i love me some sunbonnet sue i think that is a timeless classic character i, I don't want to even call it a character i don't know what to call it but an iconic image that is just awesome and i love sunbonnet sue y'all have seen this sunbonnet sue i wanted to show y'all her completely completed i found these cute little buttons in my stash and I put them on each corner, and um, and then I put the felt on the, the fabric on the back. Now, guys, this is just um, from Joann's. This is uh, remnants, y'all. Remnants are so dang cheap. Like I got this huge gray piece. There's a whole lot to this. There's I don't even know how much, but I've cut two piece giant pieces off of it, and it was like a dollar something. And I, and I know y'all are, I don't know if y'all are like me, that when you see remnants, you see this price. This is not the price. The price is way, way lower. And then there's that 50% off. So I'm getting remnants for a dollar, two dollars at the most. And I did not know that. I was like, well, that's cool. So I found some remnants for this guy's. My day of the dead fabric. I'm gonna bring I'm sorry for the motion. I just it's easier to do this on my ironing board than try to tell you what I'm doing. Anyway, I found remnants that are cotton tie-dyed purple that are like this. I found remnants of the orange. There's a tie-dye orange that's this. So I'm getting slowly getting it all together. But I'm gonna mix these two, the cat and the dog, I'm gonna mix them together in one quilt. And I know that's probably a big no-no because there's like, well, I'm a dog person. Well, I'm a cat person. If I have enough fabric, I may separate them. But I just don't know because, you know, I want to make a bigger quilt. And I want to put them together. They belong together. But in the community of animals, cats and dogs don't belong together. But you know what? This is my show, so we're going to do it my way. And so we may put these together. And if you don't like it, tough titty, said the kitty. So, 
anyway, uh, if you go on Sunny Crochet on Facebook, I'm selling this um, for twenty dollars. I'm gonna sell it for twenty dollars. Um, it's eight by nine. It's on the back. I didn't put the loops on it. You can hot glue, and you can even hot glue on this more decorations if you want to. If you want to have cloud buttons or something, you know, you're more than welcome to always modify these. Um, hang on a minute, guys. Let me get me situated. And I've started a box of these. I still got this one. The, my first one I did. I love this one. And I'm going to do it again, but with a, um, different colors. And then I still have my welcome one. And, uh, I, all of these are for sale. Um, and most of my prices include shipping, so you don't really have to worry about paying shipping. Because uh, I tell you, honest, the truth is I pay a lot of shipping, guys. Um, when I ship something to you, I'm eating shipping. Like, seriously. Y'all may pay maybe a dollar or two in shipping while I pay eight or nine of it. And that's just because I want y'all to have that product. And I don't want it to be a barrier of why you can't get what you want. Um, cause that's a big deal with me is, okay, I found what I like, but it's $3 and shipping's $8. I mean, that don't make any sense. So that's why I try to ship as cheap as I can and or include it in the price or something like that. So you're like thinking, dang, eight by nine is $20. That's a little much. No. It includes my work, it includes the product, and it includes shipping. So, shipping's gone up. I don't know what the deal is, but shipping has gone up. But anyway, I'm going to quit rambling. I got to go. But I wanted to show you. And these are stamps, so you cannot get them wet, and you cannot use iron on them. So, I have to work with wrinkles and just smooth it out as best as I can when I get it done, embroidered. Um, and then sew them together and everything and make one big piece so i like this better than the already completed blankets because you can hide your stitches with batting on the already completed blanket that they already have sewed with the stamped on it you're going to see the back side and i don't like that i don't like seeing my back sides well some back sides i like seeing <laughs> especially if it's in tight ass wranglers Whew. Mm, mama george Strait, here i come anyway y'all i love y'all have a good night